Cheap Florida Vacation Rentals, Where to Find Them. Ready for a vacation? Thinking about Florida, but wondering if it'll be too expensive? You are in luck! If you are searching for cheap Florida vacation rentals, this article will help you find them. You will find some of the best rates in the United States when you vacation in Florida. From the Florida Keys to the Orlando area and Magic Kingdom to the Florida Panhandle, there are affordable vacation homes if you know where to search. We used to automatically search for a hotel room when booking a vacation. Today, that is not usually your best option as far as cost. Rental homes, many with a private pool and hot tubs, are often much less expensive than a hotel room. Even better, the more people you include in your vacation plans, the less expensive it'll be. The first thing to consider when planning a beach vacation, Walt Disney World vacation, or any trip to Florida is the time of year. Certain times of the year, like spring break, the rates for any accommodations are high. Also, more families tend to travel when schools are out during the summer, Christmas breaks, as well as other holidays. If you're traveling with a family and can choose a different time of year, you can get some amazing deals. Cheap Central Florida Vacation Rentals Starting in Central Florida, specifically the theme parks, you can find some amazing deals. When my girls were younger, we always rented a place with a fully equipped kitchen so we could have breakfast before going to the park and dinner afterward. Much less expensive that way. If you plan your trip to Disney, SeaWorld Orlando, or Universal Studios Florida off-season, you will be pleasantly surprised at how little you pay per night. A vacation home a short drive from Disney starts about $80 per night. Definitely kind to your bank account. I found the best vacation rentals for this area on Verbo. Beautiful homes, many with swimming pools, three and four bedrooms, a popular destination in the sunshine state of Florida. In January, you can enjoy a week at the perfect vacation rental for as little as $600 a week. Easy access to all the parks for an enjoyable family vacation. Check out the deals here, Orlando Verbo. Cheap Southeast Florida Vacation Rentals over to Fort Lauderdale and Miami, as well as other major cities in South Florida where you can fly into Miami International Airport. Here, the days are warm and the nights jamming. The average price is about $80 per night for a hotel room that sleeps four. Watch the sunrise over the Atlantic Ocean, then enjoy the day on the beach. Miami is a popular tourist destination that tends to be busy during winter as snowbirds look to get out of the cold. Everything from hotel suites to luxury vacation rentals await your visit. For Miami, Fort Lauderdale, and all South Florida destinations, I tend to use kayak for my research. Like the commercial says, one site and done. Miami Beach. You may be wondering why I'm suggesting a hotel. Well, the reason is that there are areas in Miami you need to be careful when visiting. If you're not familiar with Miami, your best bet is a hotel near your destination that provides security near Miami Beach or South Beach. Fort Lauderdale, West Palm Beach, and Boca Raton also offer affordable accommodations for families as well as luxury rental properties. Winter is Miami's high season. For the best deals, plan your vacation outside the months of November through March. Also, take a look at these other options for best Florida coast beaches. Cheap Florida Keys Vacation Rentals How about the Florida Keys? Can you find cheap beach homes to rent and other affordable accommodations? Absolutely, if you know when to go and the right place to start your search. Fall is off-season for the Keys. One thing to keep in mind is this is also hurricane season. High demand periods are December through February. Warm temps welcome those tired of winter to white sandy beaches and average temps in the 70s. Key West's Southernmost Point Key West is such a unique place to visit, and for me, I've found the best way to search for a rental is to read the reviews on TripAdvisor. Why? There are literally so many accommodation types from an RV and a campground to the perfect home around the corner from the southernmost point. For those that like a resort experience, summer, fall is the best time to look for those type of accommodations. The temperatures are hotter than the rest of the year, as well as being hurricane season. Up the east coast of Florida, you will find options more affordable than South Florida and the Florida Keys. For more bang for your buck, 
Look at smaller beach towns such as Jacksonville, Vero Beach, Cocoa Beach, Kennedy Space Center, and Cape Canaveral, and New Smyrna Beach. But don't get me wrong, these beach towns can get busy, but also not to the extent of St. Augustine and Daytona. I recently enjoyed beautiful accommodations in New Smyrna Beach. It was the perfect location with easy access, not only from North and South Florida, but Central Florida as well. New Smyrna Beach less than 60 minutes from Orlando, and you can have your feet in the sand. Nearby Ocala National Forest also has options for nature lovers. This area offers cabins as well as very affordable camping choices for RVs and tents. Southwest Florida Rentals Moving to the Gulf of Mexico, the southwest portion of the state, including Fort Myers, Sanibel Island, and Captiva Island. This area is recovering from the direct hit they recently took from Hurricane Ian. Many rental properties are being used for those that have been misplaced or are not able to live in their homes. It's a good idea to hold off visiting this part of the state during the rebuild, as property rentals are scarce. But never fear, Florida is strong, and they're rebuilding as I'm saying this. I will come back and update this once things are getting better. Cheap West Central Florida Vacation Rentals Moving up toward the Emerald Coast of Florida. Your choices for affordability are best during the low season, between the months of October through December, but before the Christmas holiday. Beautiful white sandy shorelines greet you the moment you see the Gulf Coast. Search for the perfect beach house in Clearwater Beach, Treasure Island, and all throughout the Tampa Bay area. My last visit, we rented a home through Verbo in St. Pete that was literally less than 10 minutes to the white sand beaches of St. Pete, Clearwater, and Treasure Island. We had such a great time, and the cost per night for the four of us? Less than $80. Clearwater Beach. This may not work for everyone. I live in Florida, so I was able to pick up my friends from the Tampa St. Pete Airport before heading to the beach rental. If you don't know someone in Florida, be sure to include the price of a rental car or check with Uber or my favorite hire a car rental company. Cheap Florida Panhandle Vacation Rentals. This brings us to my favorite part of the state to vacation. You guessed it, Panama City Beach. PCB, Miramar Beach, Rosemary Beach, or Seacrest Beach. Blue Mountain Beach, Grayton Beach, Fort Walton Beach, Destin and Pensacola Beach. All of these fantastic options. But where should you start your search? Airbnb may be the best known, but Booking.com actually has the most options. A quick search is showing rentals at $69 a night during the off-season. White sands await you on this beautiful part of the state, but be sure to get out of town before spring break. This area gets hit hard by kids from the southern part of the USA through the Midwest in spring. Panama City Beach Temps are a bit cooler off-season, but there are still plenty of sunny days to be enjoyed. If visiting the Panhandle during the winter months is fine by you, you can easily get a place with enough space for a large family for under $750 to $1,000 a week. Smaller is less expensive. If you are looking to really get a good deal, look for a smaller home with an open concept layout. The home will feel more spacious, and you can easily toss down a few inflatable mattresses as needed.